We're here at ITU Telecom World 2013 in Bangkok, Thailand, and I'm very pleased to be joined by Mr. John Frederick Baxos, who is CEO of Telenor and is also Chairman of GSMA. Mr. Baxos, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you for being here. I'd like to start off by asking you about this year's events theme is embracing change in a digital world. What do you see as the biggest opportunities in that change for the industry and for society and the biggest challenges? I think that ITU uh, on this session here in Bangkok has uh, managed to um, put uh, into focus the play between regulators, governments, investments to be done and the service development that is ongoing. We see a step change uh, in the uh, ICT industry in these days where internet access has become uh, the real mantra of uh, what we're doing. And in the Telenor Group, we have formulated our own strategy for that by saying internet for all. We have seen uh, that we in Asian markets have been able to basically bring voice on SMS to everyone. Now it's about to do the same on internet access. This is the great opportunity, but there are plenty of challenges moving from where we are to realizing that. But it is also a great opportunity, not the least for those people that uh, has this phenomenal possibility ahead of them. And for the Telena Group also now uh, pointing to services in Myanmar, this will all happen in, uh, in such a new greenfield, which we are now uh, looking for in 2014. I was going to say, uh, how is uh, Telenor embracing the change? The technologies are facilitating a lot of new things. Um, it's remarkable how we move around with the internet in our pockets. And we've got used to it. But we are still only a few, a small percentage uh, of the population that has that benefit. So we are embracing these change factors in such a way that we say, internet for all. And we solidly believe that this will be realized in the years to come. Because think of it yourself. You remember when you got internet. You remember when you got your first mobile phone. We all do that. So for those that is still not connected and not having reached that uh, status, we need to get them there. Because it enables and empowers and from that perspective, it also has a phenomenal impact on societies at large. Finally, I'd like to ask you, we're here at ITU Telecom World 2013. What, in your opinion, is the value of attending events such as these? I think that when we heard uh, the um, uh, Secretary General uh, yesterday spoke about um, how the different stakeholders in this value chain plays together, I think that is the main message that needs to be uh, taken out. Because it is a relationship, direct relationship between how policymakers, regulators and governments forms the framework for the industry. And if they can get these for, uh, formulas right, then investments happens. And when investments happens, then services comes around and then people. Uh, also uh, becomes uh, connected to reap the benefits of being connected in, in, the, in the longer run. Mr. Baxos, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you.